Huge news right here coming up for you guys for some Halo action for you. We had the HCS Invitational at the South by Southwest event down in Austin, Texas. It's going to be a Halo 3 4v4 tournament with along with a big team battle bonanza, which is going to have YouTubers, Twitch streamers, pro players, casters, and fans all on the main stage as well. We have a snipe down versus lethal 1v1 going to be happening. $5,000 prize for a Halo 3 open FFA out there as well. How to check out these streams and potentially gigantic news for the MCC. Stay tuned throughout the whole video to understand all the details. How's it going everybody? It's Kevin here once again giving you another gameplay commentary. We're giving you some news and information on the recent happenings in Halo. We have a new event over in Austin, Texas in March, the South by Southwest event. So I'm going to give you the, all the details you're going to need to know before going in on this. Uh, I'm highly thinking about going and checking out this event because this looks like a ton of fun. A really community driven event here and so if you like this kind of news information videos please make sure to tap that like button as it greatly helps out the channel let's me know you want to see some more content like this leave a comment down below if you guys are going to try and make it to south by southwest because i'm really thinking about it like really really thinking about it. I'm, I'm making my travel plans right now as we speak and if you guys are new to the channel and stay updated with anything halo related please make sure to tap subscribe with the bell because we all know sub boxes can be kind of weird at times so let's get right into the video here like I said at the beginning of this video, guys, they have the HCS Invitational at the South by Southwest event in Austin, Texas, which will take place March 15th through the 17th. Now, South by Southwest, if you guys don't know, it's not just like a gaming thing, but it's like a multimedia cultural event thing, a very popular music event as well as some film, interactive media, and just pretty much anything to do. It's a very multicultural, multi-experience kind of event, which is really interesting. And there's a big thing about gaming there, and well, guess what? Halo's gonna have some esports going on there. This is some HCS sanctioned events, not like the UGC event back in January. We're talking a 343 HCS sponsored event here with $100,000 in prizing on the line. So this is an invitational. So the top six teams from the UGC event were invited to this 4v4 event here. So right here we have Tox, Denial, Reciprocity, Lux, Status Quo, and GMS. With all this being a double elimination round. So pretty much going to be starting off with the best of the best and ending with the best of the best of the best. With Tox and Denial actually starting their bracket in the second round because obviously they you know, were, did so well on the UGC event that they kind of get a little head start and everybody else. So that leaves Reciprocity, Lux Game and Status Quo, and GMS to kind of really battle it out. And from how things turned out at UGC, I would have to go with Tox. I mean, they were so dominant in the last round. But Reciprocity, Lux status quo gms are all very good teams as well and they could surprise you and they maybe do some roster changes to where it could really mix up the team chemistry and then give you something totally different but tox is still very favorited on this one and there's also going to be a 2v2 halo 3 tournament happening here which is going to be kind of interesting how to do it. it's gonna be kind of like a pro-am kind of situation what they're doing here because uh, they're, what they're going to do is have the best players of Halo 3 at Microsoft Store competitions that are going to be taking place. They're going to be divided up into different regions, West Coast, Central, Northeast, and Southeast. Now with each, the best players from those regions will be flown down to South by Southwest to be teamed up with actual pros. So we have the West Coast with Straight Sick, the Central Division with Flame Sword, the Northeast Division with Snakebite, and the Southeast Division with Pistola. Now one thing I think is actually going to be really interesting as well is going to be the Big Team Battle Bonanza. This is one hell of a name. I'm sure I'm the same person who came up with Super Duper Fiesta probably came up with the name with this one. But basically how this one event is going to be working, it's going to be a live stream with the Big Team Battle playlist using Halo 3. And you're going to have players from uh, pro players, you're going to have casters, HDS grassroots content creator, so that's going to be Vito, Action Man, and Ubernick, along with fans in attendance as well, can jump in on the main stage and be part of the big team battle matches here, which I think is absolutely awesome. That's one thing I've never seen with uh, a Halo event where you have like a pro-am experience, where you have the pro players, obviously, you have amateurs, say like probably the content creators or people like me even, get a chance to play with everybody and really experience it. Like I see this often with like golfing events, which are much more kind of based around fun and just kind of like having a good time kind of thing, rather than being like proving you're the best at the game kind of thing like you see it like majors in golf tournaments uh, but these pro-ams are a lot of fun and i think this is really cool that they integrate that kind of same idea to these 
uh, HCS events. I would really love to see us moving forward. And we'd be much more like involving the community more rather than having your pro players, your content creators, your fan base, three, four, three up here. You know what I'm talking about. So kind of blending it all together as we, we all love the game. We all love playing Halo. And that's something I think that uh, it's such a great idea that three, four, three is kind of integrating all these parts of the community together to just experience the game together. It's fantastic. Now there is a 1v1 going down here between Snipe Down and Lethal. If you guys don't know, there's a little bit of a history between these guys because uh, if you guys don't remember that uh, they actually used to be on the same team together. I believe this was uh, right up until the X Games of 2016 where Lethal actually kind of bounced that right out of there and uh, joined up with like the Optic team which eventually became Tox and you know basically created like a bit of a Halo Dynasty with that move. Uh, but it kind of was like a, you know, kind of a sketchy move leaving right before the X Games event. That's where commonly was able to come in for uh, Evil Geniuses and win that event. But uh, it's uh, kind of funny to see how this is turning out. So what they're going to be doing is having Snipe Down versus Lethal being a 1v1 tournament here. Or just a showdown kind of thing. But it was interesting here, talking about the booth in this section here. Where it says not only will we have a jam-packed broadcast going all weekend long. We'll also have a booth at South by Southwest for fans in attendance to hang and go hands on as well. But what it sounds like to me, to me that like, I guess maybe fans will be able to have a chance to have themselves live streamed on like the Halo Twitch or the Mixer channel. And you get to see them playing Halo. Like it's gonna be just like probably like a 24 hour, just like nonstop streaming. Like I said, there's gonna be a Halo 3 open FFA tournament. So anyone in attendance can play this and have a chance to win $5,000. Now, if I do remember correctly, the last two major events for free, I had free for all tournaments, Ryan Noob, and the winning both of those so you guys will probably have some very strong competition i'm sure like i mentioned earlier the grassroots team will be there so minus naden i guess he won't be able to make it but you have action man ubernick and Vito. they'll also be on stream as well so you get to come by check out your favorite streamer content creator and hang out by their stream watch them play some halo and probably interact with the community as well and it's going to be one fantastic time for sure and i'm sure the news you're all been waiting for the MCC news. Well, right here on the post, it mentions here exactly. It says, not only will you be treated to amazing matches and gameplay, but you'll also have some exciting MCC news to reveal during the show. Obviously, this is going to be strictly speculation, but I have some rather educated guesses when it comes to what we're going to be seeing for the MCC. Now, in the last update, they mentioned about things coming forward to the MCC. They mentioned IP masking so people can't be DDoS out of their games. Also, a post-game Carnage Report update. And so those two things I don't think are very much worth announcing as big news coming to the MCC. But another thing they did mention that was like the custom game browser, if you will, much like in Halo 5, they're going to be bringing it to MCC. Now they've been talking about this for a few months, but it has not been implemented yet. So if there's going to be a big announcement for the MCC, I would think it would probably be the release date of the custom game browser. Now in the previous post, it did mention that they're looking to put this out to the MCC Insider build before releasing it to the public. So either I would not think even that though would be an announcement for players to bring up at South by Southwest where obviously not everybody's in the MCC Insider program. So what would be something that everyone could be looking forward to that everyone's going to get? It would be one, a new game like Halo Reach. I'm just saying like we've been waiting for that one. And they know, they know that uh, we want that in the MCC. Um, to maybe even ODST Firefight added in there. That would be pretty freaking sweet. Or, what well, a lot of people kind of been rumbling about recently a lot more, which uh, I'll, I'll pure speculation or just want, and then they know that they want, people want this, is the MZC coming to PC, possibly the Windows Store. You know, obviously that this uh, recent resurgence of the MCC has kind of been kind of trying to build up the community before the release of Halo Infinite and Infinite's going to be on PC and on Xbox. So what a great way to start building up your PC player base by releasing the MCC on PC. Now I did hear rumors from other like YouTube videos, obviously nothing confirmed. 343 might actually have a working PC build of the MCC and it's just been kind of sitting there due to the poor state the game was in. But now that the game is actually functioning very properly now, it could be possible that it'd be okay to release the game on PC for the Windows Store or maybe even Steam. 
thank God, hopefully, maybe Steam. But so that would be an absolutely groundbreaking announcement if MCC came to the PC. Or if you just brought in Reach or brought in ODST Firefly as well. Those would be awesome additions. So to reorganize my thoughts on that one for my predictions. It could be either going to be a custom game browser for the big announcement. MCC going to the PC. You're going to have maybe, maybe Reach on the MCC. Or you might have ODST Firefight on MCC. Obviously those are pure speculation, educated guesses at best. So now I'm not trying to give you any fake news here. I'm just giving some speculation because I don't mind you give you just fake to straight news. I want to give you some opinions as well while we're doing this. And that's the entire update guys. I am very excited about this. I am legitimately working out the costs right now to see if I can make it to South by Southwest because if I do that would be so freaking cool. I'd love to get a chance to meet up with all the content creators like I did back at PAX and do it again here at South by Southwest. And plus I haven't gone on a vacation in years. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. If you want, like this kind of video and want to see more like it, make sure to tap that like button. Let me know you want to see some more content like this. Leave a comment down below, guys, what your thoughts are on the South by Southwest event. Me, I am extremely hyped about it. If you're new to the channel, stay up to date with anything Halo related, please make sure to tap subscribe. And if you're new to the channel and miss any content from me, check out the videos on the screen right now. I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace out.